The Freeman Station, located on Plains Road in Burlington, just received its fourth grant from the Ontario Trillium Foundation. Freeman Station volunteer Bob Miller tells us what the grant will be used for. It will allow us to do something that we always dreamed of, and that would be to have a video uh, display on that back wall there. And uh, we're going to do that during the course of this year. It should be finished by the end of this year. And uh, that will allow us to not only show the uh, videos of old railway and old time pictures, but we'll also be able to use it as an education tool for the school visits that come in here. We'll teach them how a steam engine runs. Uh, we'll do uh, panoramic views. We'll, we'll also, because this uh, bottom portion of the station is, uh, is not accessible, uh, we will beam up from that video wall through cables upstairs and that'll come up on the big TV set upstairs so that the uh, visitors who can't come down the stairs, they can see what we're displaying downstairs here. Private donors, community partners, and volunteers have all played a key role with the ongoing growth of the station. Well, we're, we're real happy to have all the support that we've gotten from, you know, not just the grants, but the private donors too. There have been a lot of people that came here and donated equipment and, and donated money to support this. And like you mentioned, the, uh, the folks from M.M. Robinson, the trade program, they finished all the walls here and uh, that, was, that was just uh, a, a wonderful thing. Uh, we've, we're trying to involve the community in, in a lot of ways in our open houses, our displays upstairs, and of course this, which is uh, a replica of what the community was like in the 1920s. What is your hope and your vision for the station as the years go by? Well, we, we hope it just keeps, uh, you know, becoming more and more of a place to go, you know, a, a, a community attraction, you know, something that's also good for visitors, you know, it helps the, the tourism effort in Burlington. And it, it'll change. We want to keep doing new things with regard to educating people. There's a million stories to be told about various things here. We can display it on the video board. Uh, we're, we just hope that people will keep coming back to keep returning here. Freeman Station is truly a station built by our community. And with the latest grant from the Ontario Trillium Foundation, the volunteers here will be able to continue along their great work for our community. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Kimberly Calderbank.